everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. Hope you all enjoyed that little cinematic, little cinematic, cinematic cinema thing that I did. I think that turned out pretty well. I don't know actually yet. I haven't edited it, but I'm hoping that it turned out looking pretty good. But I just wanted to kind of show you in shaders what we've done, what I've added to this here sheriff's office. As you can see here, we have a bunch more detail out of where are these stupid spiders? They are driving me crazy. I must find the spiders. They are driving me crazy. I found them. I found the source of the spiders. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, cave spiders. That's why. That would do it. That would do it. Ow! Poison! Why? Why did that knock me back? Does poison, like, knock you back now? The heck, man? Get out of here. 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 You dumb... You dumb spiders. There's more. There's more. Oh no, this is bad. This is real bad. This is real, real, real bad, man. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I can't hit him. Oh, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. This is so bad. Get me out of here. Bookshelves, save me. Oh, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Man, I'm out. Oh my gosh. That was terrifying. Never again. Ever. That was scary, man. Alright, we're doing it again. We got this. We have to destroy what lurks within these dark cavernous caverns of caverniness. And then I can show you what the heck is going on, what I've been working on off camera and stuff. Where are these spiders? Where are they? I must, I must eradicate the spiders from these lands. Alright, let's do this. Get our sword, chop our way through these stupid cobweb spider webs. I think that's all of them. Okay, cool. Hopefully, that got rid of this spider infestation, because I ain't about it, man. I'm not about no dang spider infestation. Not today, not now, not ever. So, let's go back up topside and let me go sleep real quick, and then we will continue showing you what I've been working on off camera. So, I'm gonna sleep real quick and I will be right back. Alrighty, we are here, we are in the house, and I might as well just give you a little tour of what's going on. Here we got the top floor where the uh, sheriff is sleeping, he got a little tower, clock tower, grandfather clock, sort of mini grandfather clock style clock here. Got some bookshelves, I guess that can also act as a table if you want. Sort of like a little shelf there. Some carpet. You've got your little furnace here with some more bookshelves and stuff. Some more carpet. Nothing too crazy. I didn't know what else to add up here. Little railing so you don't fall off the edge. And then we have a nice plant down here with a little place where the sheriff sits and makes sure everyone's following the law. And when criminals come in, the sheriff does his sheriffly duties and does whatever he has to do. I'm thinking of making an area, ooh, that could be cool actually, if we did something like get rid of this, and then in here we have a sort of like area down there where the cells and stuff are. That's a cool idea actually. I kind of like that. Kind of like that idea. Yeah, that's what's going on there. Might have to implement that idea today actually because I just like that idea so much. But yeah, we got some window shutters here for the windows, adding some more detail. Got some flower boxes up there with no flowers in them yet. Oh, also, big thing, I've linked up a nether portal from my old base to this base so now I can just travel through the nether and we won't have to run all the way back through the overworld to get back to my original base. So, let me my let me my let's go and I'll just give you the tour of how quick it is to get back. As you can see, we have our nether portal placed right here, looking cool, looking fine, looking fantastic. And I'm gonna show you the route that we take to get back. It actually doesn't take a long time at all. I did this. We're going all the way back through the nether 
to our original base because why the heck not man but yeah I've been doing work I've been doing a lot of off-camera work because I've been wanting to make some progress on this if you guys have any ideas for this Western build please do not hesitate to put it down in the comments I love reading your guys' comments I love re responding to you replying to you and just like I want this to be our build I don't want it to just be me building I want you guys to have your own ideas and input as well so if you have any cool ideas that you'd be wanting to share, let me know down in the comments below. But yeah, there's the portal right there. It's not a far, not a far run at all. Not at all. Then you go right through here, and we actually need to go grab some flowers. That's why I'm coming back here anyways. And look, we've made it back to our original base. It's great. It's fantastic. Nether transportation is amazing. I'm thinking of actually adding a rail cart to that so I don't have to run and waste my food. But that is for another time. Let's grab one of these orchids and let's grab an oxide daisy. Actually, let's... Oh, I didn't even grab one, did I? Nope. Grab an azure bluet. Grab one of those, one of those. There we go. What are these? Oh, the carpet. I gotcha. Hi, Julius. How you doing? Doing fantastic. Fantastic. That's what I like to hear. All right. Let me head back to my origin, not original base, to my western base, and I will see you all there. All right. We have made it back. I have gathered up some materials, and we are going to work on getting the cells, the jail cells, all fixed up, set up, looking good. But first, I need to put down some of these. I probably could have brought some grass blocks over because I'm pretty sure I have some at the other base, but it's fine. It looks good. Yeah, I like that. I like that little pop of color, the little blue and white color there. I think it looks real nice, man. I like that a lot. All right, so let's do this. We're going to be making a little jail cell area down in there. And you'll never even know because it's sort of hidden down there. I think that's going to look super cool. Super excited for how this is going to turn out. So I went ahead, grabbed some iron bars. We need to make some ladders, though. Got our crafting table right here. Super convenient. And then let's just make this. Make a bunch of sticks so that we can make some more ladders like that. There we go. Looking good. All right, let's start ladders right there. You still, you won't really notice unless you're like right here. And even there, like you hardly notice. Maybe we should actually... I kind of like seeing the ladder though. Like a little bit of the ladder is fine. Okay, so then we'll go one... Two. Every time I say, okay, so, okay, so, I hear the word queso. And I just think of like queso, like cheese dip. And I'm just like, dang. Dang, man. I say okay so a lot. I say it a lot. A lot, a lot. I need to find other words to say rather than those words. Um, I was about to say it again. Okay so. Jeez, man, I can't. I don't even know. My vocabulary needs to improve on this because my commentary is lacking. Let's go three blocks like this something like this and then we'll also raise the roof raise the roof boy up one block one block more just like this perfect maybe we should actually leave yeah no we'll figure it out here let's put a light down it's probably pretty dark down here we're going to chop all this out and then we're going to figure out how to do some jail cells for these jail cell prisoner peoples it's gonna be real nice okay so how do again okay so my goodness man now i'm noticing it every time i say it i don't think these really need to look nice necessarily but what i could use is some cobblestone so um again so and okay so i'm just i can't man every time i say that now it's just gonna bother me just gonna be like stop saying that and I'm gonna be like I can't stop saying it because that's just what I say when I need a filler word but you don't need filler words I mean you think you need filler words but filler words aren't necessarily necessary 
you just kind of say them because you don't want that awkward pause whenever you can't think of something to say for a hot minute because you feel like you need to continuously talk in the YouTube commentaries because that's what you're supposed to do. Quote unquote, supposed to do. There's no right or wrong way to do it. You just do whatever, whatever you want to do is the right way to do it. Whatever you want to do, go for it. There's no right or wrong way to do commentary on YouTube. I mean, there's a way that some people do it, but that's different than the way that others do it. Everyone has their own flavor, their own style. That makes them unique, man. That's what makes everyone different and unique and great and fantastic. If everyone was the same, I feel like it'd be extremely boring. Here, let's... Uh, do we want to make... Yeah, we want to make this cobblestone, and then we'll probably do something with the walls at some point, but... We will save that for another time. All I want to do really right now is get the floor all fixed up, looking good. Oh, it's dark down here now. It's real dark. Oh, is this four? Maybe we should bring it out. Um, let's actually fill this wall back in because I want it three. I want an even area. So let's just do this and there, place those, and then the brown. Whoa, that's not what I want. That, oh, we put the brown away, whatever. Ah, it's gonna bug me. It's going to bug me. Here, I'm gonna go grab some brown stained clay and I'll be right back. All right, I have gathered up the brown clay, the brown stained clay from the storage back at home base. We're just gonna fill this in. And I think we'll probably just have like one cell down here or something. We don't need a huge amount of room or... S oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No. This needs to be like that because we're going to do this. We are going to do this. Also, I grabbed a cauldron because I have an idea that I'm going to use for this cauldron design. For this cell design. And we are going to implement it right now. Have a little toilet right there for the prisoner. All right, looking good. Looking real good, man. So what we could do here, I don't know why I grabbed all these stone bars, iron bars, but we have a few iron bars there. Looking good. And then what we could have is an iron door, right like so. And then place that there. And then we got a little jail cell right here. I like that, man. I think that looks real nice. Oh, now we just locked ourselves in. We don't want a we don't want a button on the other side because we want to make it look like the prisoner is a prisoner and not actually going to be able to escape. Hmm. Okay. Got ourselves. A, ooh. What we could do is actually, if we wanted to. No, I don't think that would look good. But we got a little jail cell down here now. That's looking good. If the prisoner ever escapes, though, this sheriff is in deep trouble because he comes out right where the sheriff is, which actually isn't a bad idea because the sheriff would hear him escaping out of the jail cell. And then he comes down here to look, and he's like, hey, get back in your cell. Blah, 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 blah. Get back in your cell. And then he's like, okay, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. Then this door could, like, lock or something. Yeah, that's a really cool idea, actually. I like that a lot. I really, really like that idea. That looks super cool. I think we've done a good thing here today, my friends. I really like how this looks. Maybe we should add like a bed or something in there or something. Let me know what, ooh, oh, 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 oh. We could do this for a bed. Just a little rug, a little wool rug thing for a bed. I think it looks better if they're both white because it just stands out, it pops out from the floor a little better. Yeah, that looks good. We have a little bed there. I think that looks real nice. Real nice. All right, well, I think that's gonna wrap up this episode for today, my friends. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to lick that like button. <laughs> lick that like button. That's what I always say on Twitch. Lick that follow button. Now you gotta lick that like button on YouTube. I would very much appreciate it. Let's go harvest these real quick. But yeah, if you did enjoy the video, I would appreciate if you gave it a thumbs up, shared it out on your social media, just shared the video out however you want to. Get the word out there. I would greatly appreciate it because I have been trying to put more effort into making these videos, trying to do more off-camera stuff and just kind of different styles of editing, like the little time lapse in the beginning of this and stuff. So yeah, I'm trying to put more work into it and I hope you guys appreciate it. 
But yeah, if you did enjoy, don't forget to lick that like button and subscribe to the channel if you don't if you haven't done so already. And as always, my name is Silent Scale. I will see you all next time.